So this question uh, is looking at um, ingredients. Uh, it's got a recipe question. It's kind of a ratio recipe question here because we're looking at a recipe for 12 scones. So again, we read all the information carefully. Um, Viv is making scones for 15 people, so that's important. Um, she's making two scones for each person. That's obviously important as well. So from this information, we can see we've got to work out the amount of ingredients she needs for doing these 15 people, two scones each. So first thing we need to obviously recognize is we actually need to make 30 scones. So again, highlighting key information is allowing us to kind of get the marks as we go through for method. So what have we got? We've got the recipe for 12. So we want 30. So 30 divided by 12 is 2 and a half. If we're not quite sure of doing it that way, then we could say to ourselves, well, 30 is made up of 12 plus 12, that's 24, plus 6. Well, we could see that that's half of 12. So we need two lots of the recipe plus an extra half. So if we take the flour, one recipe of uh, 12 needs 220, another one needs 220 again, but then we need half the recipe again, so we need 110. So if we add all those up, so 220, 420, 440, 540, 550. So we can see then, uh, just filling in the answers, answer line, that we're going to need 550 grams of raisin flour. And we do the same thing for the other ingredients. We need 40 for 12, 40 for another 12, and then we need half the recipe again. So again, we add those up, 40, 80, 100. And for milk, we needed 150 for one recipe of 12, another 150, and then half again, and a half, 150, 75, 150, 300, 375. And then for sugar, it was two tablespoons for each recipe of 12, and the half of two is one, so we need five spoonfuls of sugar. So butter we needed a hundred, milk we needed three hundred and seventy-five milliliters, and sugar we needed five tablespoons. So again, highlighting key information, make sure we don't miss anything. Uh, so we need two scones for fifteen people. Hence the reason we're working out for thirty. Look at ways of uh, looking how we're going to change the recipe for twelve. Uh, into a recipe for 30 and 12 built up to 30 by having one lot, the second lot was 24 scones and then half again. So a recipe question.